boy Dre done, man. Uh, so, my team, my squad, the Lakers, just, well, it's not official yet, but there's been talks and multiple sources have said that uh, the Lakers have reached an agreement or are on the verge of reaching an agreement with Yee Giuliani. If you do not remember Yee Giuliani, he was the supposed to be the next Yao Ming, um, the next big player out of China, about, I'm going to say, five, six, seven years ago. And he was actually a really a, a really decent player. He put up some great stats. He was with the New Jersey Nets. He put up some really good stats. He only played like four or five years. Him and Yao Ming, when the Nets went against the Rockets, it was like one of the highest grow, highest uh, watch games in the history of China. Um, the dude aver actually, I think he averaged like nineteen and ten a year. Like he had, he averaged a double double a year. So, like he's a pretty decent player, and he's even better now, supposedly, from what we've seen with him playing over in China and playing against the U.S. team over in China. He was killing us in that game. In the, in the uh, Olympics, um, it was the pre-Olympic game. Um, okay, yeah, but um, a lot of Laker fans are like pissed off, pissed off about it. I mean, we're paying Timothy Mosgrave fucking twenty million a year. So he's just a fucking scrub. For, now we got uh Yee Giuliani, pay him eight million and you're mad about that? Like this is the thing about Laker fans. We think we think we're supposed to get fucking superstars. Just, oh, if it's not a superstar, I'm not happy about getting him. Like a lot of Laker fans are just so delusional. Um But I mean you gotta get what you can get. I really think we have a great young nucleus. Um, I think D'Angelo Russell is gonna be one of the top five players in the league in the next five years. Uh, that's how good I think that dude is. Not just because he's playing for the Lakers, but just just seeing his growth, just seeing how he's getting his game together. I think he could be like a better version of James Harden. Cause and people are thinking he's gonna be a passer. I think this guy's a natural born scorer. When I watched him at Ohio State, he was a scorer. He was a good passer too, but I think. His scoring is what's going. That's what's going to stick out for him, and in, in the NBA, that's what's going to make him his money. His scoring. Um, Jordan Clarkson, man, he's just getting better and better every year. First year he was good. Last year he was even better. Without Kobe there, now he's going to get more shots. Going to get more playing time. That's going to be crazy. Um, Julius Randle. He's going to be one of the best low post players, one of the strongest guys in the league. When LeBron retires, Randall's going to be the strongest guy in the league. Um, monster. He's like a power. I don't want to say a power forward LeBron because LeBron is LeBron. Like, when you call somebody LeBron, it's serious shit. But um, I, I really think we have a lot of guys. And Ingram. I mean, Durant's even said, I look at this guy. He reminds me of me. Lakers fans, you have the future ahead of you. You don't have to, oh, we need to win titles. Look, rebuild. All these other teams, look who's winning titles in the NBA now. Not two t one team's going to win titles the next three years. The Warriors. The Warriors are going to kill everyone for the next three years unless somebody puts together a super team. Um, that's just was how it's going to go. Um, but, man, um, I just I just need to do this little message, man. I, this little uh, video, cause I'm I'm glad that we got you, Giuliani, cause Miles and Miles Golf's hurt anyway. He has a groin injury, but man, I we signed him, man. I wasn't even mad, cause it's like a lot of people who, a lot of people who don't des who not like max players got max deals. Like Mike Conley, who I respect a lot. Even ever I've been following him since Ohio State days. When he was on the on the, when they went to the championship. He ain't worth it. He ain't no damn max player. <laughs> Mike Cully ain't no damn max player, man. Memphis out of stock. But hey, you got the money, you got to use it. Um But congrats to that guy, man. He on the court, he probably is not a max player. I'm not gonna say he deserves it. Who the fuck am I to say just a little fucking guy from Alabama? Who the hell am I to say who deserves what? But he's not a max player. I wouldn't have gave him that money, but the guy, he's a good guy. You never hear Matt, Mike Conley being in trouble. He's the the floor general, the great defensive player. Um, 
He's a great two-way player. He's a good offensive player, too. Um, but, yeah. But, um, man, yeah. Uh, Giuliani, man. Welcome to the Lakers. At least, I hope they don't Chris Paul that shit. <laughs> you know how the NBA like to fuck with the Lakers. Um, but, yeah, man. Till next time. Go Lakers. Laker Nation, all that stuff. And uh, welcome to the team, ye. Uh, hope you put up. Hope you, you do some big things for us. Um, till next time, go go Falcons also, man. My squad, man, we back, we back this year. That five and five and zero star ain't no bullshit this year. Um, till next time, peace.